In other words, if I go to the grocery store and tell somebody, hey, I have a 300 degree angle, or if I tell somebody, hey, I have a negative 60 degree angle, I'm talking about exactly the same angle. I can have multiple ways of representing the position of this terminal line right here, some with positive, some with negative angles. In fact, I'll take this opportunity to tell you that of course I started here, I added 360 degrees to it and I got this angle. What if I add 360 degrees again? I could add 360 degrees to the 300 degree angle. What am I going to get? 660 degrees. So 360 plus the 300 is 660. So this angle also can be negative 60 degrees. It could be 300 degrees. Or if I add 360 again, it could be 660 degrees. I could add another 360 and another 360. And I can keep doing this forever. And I can come up with many, 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 an infinite number of, no of angles, uh, measurements that actually correspond to exactly the same thing. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.